new fuel technology is helping communities clean up the air. Here in Texas, one of the primary targets in efforts to cut down on air pollution is diesel vehicles. Diesel isn't the only pollutant in our air, but we know it's one of the most toxic ones. Diesel exhaust accounts for the single greatest risk from air pollution to cause cancer. New federal standards will require new diesel vehicles to be a lot cleaner. But what about all the vehicles on the roads now? That could be around for decades. Texas is utilizing fuel additives to make diesel engines burn cleaner. This plant near Houston is producing a diesel additive developed by Oryx Energy. Our mission is to be able to provide, economically provide, unique additive solutions that help the environment working with fossil fuels, refiners, and producers of fuels. Extensive tests show the additive cuts down on toxic emissions, such as NOx or nitrogen oxides, one of the main contributors to ozone pollution. It reduces emissions by altering the course of chemical reactions in the combustion process. The Oryx Energy additive is mixed with standard diesel at terminals right before it goes into fuel trucks and delivered to stations, like here, for hundreds of fleet vehicles for the city of Austin. It's probably the most effective and efficient method we have of reducing NOx, uh, which has an impact on ozone. If you're going to clean up the engine, the two ways you have to do it, you have to either do something to the engine or add something to the fuel. And obviously adding something to the fuel that just happens every time you fill up the tank is the most effective way of doing it. Along with its partners like Suncoast Resources, Oryx Energy is helping several communities cut diesel emissions and remove thousands of tons of NOx from the air. The advantage for our product is that refineries don't have to change the way they operate or make a separate fuel that needs to be segregated, handled separately, transported separately, which all adds to the cost. It's important that economics and the environment go hand in hand, and we were able to do that with this program through innovation and hard work. This new additive technology is only adding a few cents to the cost.